Today we're taking a look at an inline fabrication skylight and that's coming up next here on Jesse B Outdoors Reloading. Welcome back everybody and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Leave a comment down below if you like videos like this. Today we're taking a look at this skylight here. What we're going to do is, is we're going to take it over to the table. We're going to unbox it, show you everything it comes with. And then what we're going to do is we're going to install it here on my Dillon 500C. We're going to check it out and see how bright it is. So let's go ahead and get started. Now let's open this all up and see what comes with it here. Pop this open. And we'll just scoot everything on out of here. First thing we got on top is a business card where to get stuff from. Then we have our alcohol wipe. And what that is for is we got two cable mounts here. If I can pick them both up here. This one wants to keep falling on my hand to mount the cables. And what you're going to do is use this scouring pad to scuff it up. Use that uh, alcohol wipe to then stick those on to clean the surface. We got another card here for the like us on Facebook. Here we got the LED light that's going to be mounted on the press. And then we got our power cord here with the on off button. And on the back of this, it gives you all the instructions and everything you need to know about it. Let's go over some of the features about this. It consists of a machine bushing with an embedded high output LED pod, which installs into the center of the tool head. And as you can see here, as we're zooming in, this has 10 LEDs in it. The average life of this is 75,000 hours. It is made for easy caliber changes, which we will demonstrate later. It has a 110 plug and the cord on it is 48 inches long and it has an on off switch built into the cord. It's also available with a AA battery pack that holds eight AA batteries in case you can't use the plug in power cord. And it comes with an inline fabrications, no worries, lifetime warranty. Now what I want to do is to show you guys a couple different angles on how this is going to work. Right now it's nighttime in my room. I don't have any of my lights on except for the one light. And it is kind of dark in here. So this will be one angle I want to show you guys this at. We'll turn it on. You can see how good that lights it up right there. Let's go ahead and look at it from a different angle. Now this is the very important angle because this is the angle I'm looking at it to see the powder charge. So let's turn that on. And you can see there, once we got into focus, we can see down there just fine. And we're going to do one more angle. I want to show you what it looks like up on top. Now what I'm going to do is demonstrate a caliber change on this. I put a different tool head on here just so you guys see it a little bit better. So you can see how I got excess on the wire right here. All we got to do is pull up on that light, put it off to the side, pull our two pins to take the tool head out. And then we would slide our new tool head in grab our two pins and pop these back in to lock down the tool head and then all we would have to do is grab our light drop it right back down in the center turn it on and that's how easy it is to do a caliber change with this skylight from inline fabrications now you can see it from the back side here this is where i put my two wire ties to tie this up just so you guys could see how that was. Basically, I didn't film it because to me it's kind of boring. You just take your scouring pad, rub the spot for a little bit, get it cleaned up. Take the alcohol pad, clean that up, and then take this. And this has got 3M tape on it. Take the, peel the one part off, stick it on there after the alcohol dries. Nothing to it. Thought it'd be kind of boring to film it, but that's how you do it. So as you can see, this lights it up pretty good. And right here, I've got the on off switch. It's very nice and audible on that to turn it on and off. You definitely know when this light's on and you definitely know when it's off just by the click of that. That is a very nice touch. So I hope you guys enjoyed my video here on the inline fabrication skylight and the little demonstration I did. You can see how much it lights it up here. We'll shut it off one more time. You can see how dark it is there. And then we light it back up. You could definitely tell from the view that I would be looking down to my powder. I could see the powder charge a lot better with it with this skylight than if I had no lights on it. That was one of the issues I was having. And that's why I picked up this skylight. So far, very impressed with it. Give it a thumbs up. We will definitely be testing it out in the future by doing a lot of rounds on this press. Because this is now my main press to make up rounds for the channel. So, as always, don't forget to check the links out down below. 
Down there I have links to Axle Hearing Protection, Gators Eyewear, and a bunch of other companies I like dealing with. Some got discount codes to save you guys money. Others are affiliate accounts that do help out the channel. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Leave a comment down below. We are One Nation Under God. And I'll see you all on the next one.